Ellen has sent me this film of hers. She's riding in the 2015 Super Stakes Amateur five and six year old division. Um, we're gonna take a look and watch this film and see what we can find uh, to help you out. Entering the herd great. Your reins are at a good length. Um, so far so good. The way we're entering the herd looks good. Uh, Ellen is after the black baldy right now. Shaping it up real good. She's, I like how she keeps walking. She's steadily moving the cows out and around her. Okay. Right here, the cow is the black baldy on the inside and we're faced to the right. So we were coming up through good with the black baldy. I like how we're coming up. We're pushing through the herd. We're rolling the herd around. Now right here, let's just go ahead and start moving to our left. Okay, this herd here, our cow starting to go here. Here's our hole to just slide over, bring the black baldy out to our turn back help that's over here. Uh, right now, we're kind of getting at the angle to come at this cow's butt. So f therefore, this cow is going to feel a little bit of that, uh, what we call a bubble or in pressure to the cow. And so therefore, this cow is going to feel a little bit of that and it's going to put itself in a position to go ahead and move or take off and we don't want it to take off we're trying to encourage that cow to come out to this opening right out here so therefore my opinion of how to do that would be to move to our left therefore these cows would kind of shuffle out spread out of the way this cow would come right out here there we go that's good real good job of moving to our left okay cows are still spreading out Good, so now let's just hold right here. You have your cow, your black baldies right here. These cows are taking off. Let's just hold our black baldy right there. In this example, I believe that you should just hold it right there. And when I say hold it, just stand still and hold that black baldy. Don't let it move, don't step to it, don't try to move it so that these three cows right here can get out of the way. And if you can just hold it for that one second, this cow will open up and then you can come and bring that cow right to where you need to be. So the cow looked at you, you go to the right, now you're in a bad position. Now you're in a tough position to go cut this cow. Okay, so now when the cow gets over here, you're going to be back in that position where now you want to try to hold the black baldy over here so we can clean up these lingering cows that are out in the road. This is really where we would like for our black baldy to be is right here instead of here. Now you're going to come back and swipe up back through these cows. Now good job stepping up. Okay, and I said stepping up, but we actually didn't step up. It looked like that we were about to step up and we didn't. Okay, right here I thought we were about to step up. You know, we, we've taken ourselves in a situation right there. Um, where we're we're behind in the cutting right now. Um, you know, this is the spot where I thought we were gonna come up in the cut. Instead, we, we were gonna come up right here, and if we would've come up, we could've moved this cow up and around this cow, and instead, we're just kinda going along with the flow right here, Ellen. So that would be a spot where I would like to see you kinda come up and, and take charge and cut your cow right there. So, in the, and the judges, we're, we're minus one. We're losing points before we've even showed them what our horse can do. Uh, before we've even put our hand down, we are losing points just on the cut. So um, we would like to gain points on our cut, get up to a 72 right before we even put our hand down. Okay, you put your hand down. Now 
you know, because we've been knocking the cow around, it's going to be a, you're going to have a tough time for a cow to be uh, very good after you've went through that commotion. You know, we've, we've moved around there probably for five seconds. So we've already worked this cow for five seconds, but our hands never been down. So we're minus. A good job right there. Okay, Ellen. And what I can see is once our hand is down, um, you're doing a great job of riding, and your horse is a really good horse, a lot of eye peel, a very good stop, a very good quit right there. So in, in your particular situation, um, I, I'm marking you a 216 once our hand's down, but we had a penalty or two just getting the cow cut. So right now, uh, you are marking a 70. You quit your cow great. You're smooth entering the herd. I love how your eyes are looking around at what your help is uh, feeding you with advice of, of what our next options might be. You're doing a great job right here, staying smooth. Okay, you're coming up good. Okay, it looks like you might be cutting the yellow cow in between the two yellows, the yellow baldy and the gray cow. Let's see if you are. Okay. You know, there, there's a, there's a, so now we got another penalty right here, uh, just on the cuts. So when our hands down, we're great. Okay, let's, let's go back through here and see what's going on. So we're coming up. You're coming up really good right now. You're going to walk your cow up past these other cows over here, the yellow baldy will fall off. So in this situation, Ellen, you wanna stay steady with your hand. Don't get too like this with your hand, just keep your horse and keep your cow moving up past these other group of cattle. Okay, what happened is you went from a good situation of being straight with your horse walking up as you can see now your horse spinning out just a little bit and you and you just needed to keep your horse steady walking straight as an arrow as you could we're right here we kind of we kind of just turned him just a little bit and now he looks like he thinks you're wanting him to cut this cow so therefore he takes this cow when this is your cow that you're wanting to cut so now you're having to adjust him back and you set your hand down. You have a really nice working horse, looks real good. This is kind of one of those cows. It's another cow that's not doing anything for your score. It's a tough cow running you around, but you're doing a good job of staying in with that cow real good. Good job right there of making sure that that cow was stopped and had all four feet on the ground. I wanna go back and show you how good of a job that was on that cow of quitting. That was a tricky situation for everybody else out there watching Ellen on this uh, quit. Watch this cow, stop, look at her. She looks at the cow and makes sure all four feet are still. That was a great job, Ellen. There's a lot of positive. Once your hand's down, it's great. Now I love, you've had all these rough cuts. She's, she's hanging in the cut and she's doing everything she can to do to advance. She comes around here on the third cut, cuts a cow walking out. I love this ag aggressive cut right here. So this would be a credit earning cut right here. Now put her hand down. Good job, Ellen. Real good. And Ellen, once your hand's down, it's real good. Your, your horse has a lot of eye peel. You ride good. We just got to clean those cuts up and work on those cuts.